Good day, everyone. I hope we are all having a wonderful day. My name is Rora Remeleko, a 300-level student of the Civil Engineering Department and also a ULUS Social Secretary candidate. I want to use this as an opportunity to convey my goals and my aspirations. But before I do that, it is imperative that I let you know why I decided to embark on this journey in order to serve our great faculty. I've always been ready to lend my support, my skills and time to events here in the Faculty of Engineering. And I take great pride in seeing a properly planned and well-executed event. I have always ensured that my schedule is filled with volunteering with at least one event every year, such as the Engineering Ladies' Day, the Professor Ayodele Awujobi Design Competition, PAADC the Engineering Career Expo, ECX, and when there are no events, I ensure that one is at least organized within my sets or within my departmental year. For example, last year, a hangout was organized for my set and that went splendidly well. The next social secretary should have necessary hands-on skills and experiences to ensure the social growth of the students and the faculty as a whole. These skills include, but are not limited to, great organization and leadership skills, the knowledge of or the access to diverse people, enthusiasm and charisma, all of which I bring to the table. Now, having said that, I am very confident that you and I have become acquainted and I can proceed with my plans. I call my plan the four eyes for social growth. Uh, this plan includes, one, increased participation across social events. I mean, it's no news that social events within this great faculty of ours are a bit rigid and not as expressive. I mean, a typical engineering event holds only a mere fraction of the entire student population. While this is no fault of ours, a solution has to be made. A solution that my campaign team and I like to call the peer-to-peer -peer system, which focuses on increased participation across social events. This is a tag system which involves rewarding people for getting their peers to tag along to events, and it takes advantage of the fact that an individual is more inclined to attend an event in the company of friends. I mean, it is foolproof. A second eye is improvement and inclusion of events. I mean, the student population craves diverse events that will allow them to express themselves and also give them the freedom to unwind and buzz off the stress of our school semester, which is necessary in order to strike the balance of school and social life. These events include activities such as the silent disco, treasure hunt, Step Out and Hand Gout, Carnival, Talent Law, and many more. Ensuring inclusivity of every student, leaving no individual out. It is also important that as we organize new events, our already existing events such as the Euler's Dinner, Euler's Faculty Week, Euler's Movie Night, Mr. and Miss Engineering, and Engineering Ladies Day are not sabotaged. And they are improved through strategic planning, proper sponsorship, efforts and better publicity to I is going to be intentional partnership and sponsorship. An event cannot be successful without necessary funds. And while there are budget allocations for social events, it is necessary to form partnerships with corporate bodies, um, firms and brands. These partnerships and sponsorships will help facilitate the smooth operation of our social events. And just in case you are wondering why these brands would be interested in working with us, it's because we can offer them something much more, which is a return on investment. This might be in form of um, audience insights or direct face time with prospects, which are the students. Uh, all of these I'm able to take advantage of due to my vast knowledge in marketing certification in social media marketing and hands-on experience with helping brands build their identity. My fourth eye 
is to integrate COVID-19 protocols. We have to accept that we are currently living in a pandemic and necessary adjustments need to be made in order to ensure the safety of all our students. The last administration had to deal with COVID-19 and this interrupted all their plans. So it is imperative that we prepare accordingly by ensuring all our events are in line with COVID-19 guidelines as prepared by the NCDC. I hope to serve this great faculty in the capacity of the ULS Social Secretary and I hope your votes reflect your voice. Come Wednesday, ensure you vote right, vote or a remilefo for ULS Social Secretary. Thank you for your time and God bless you. Bye.